Well, welcome guys, and welcome to another entry from the vault. So today we have Final Fantasy Origins. Released for the PlayStation 1 in 2003, developed by Tose, and published by Square slash Infogrames. So this is a compilation of Final Fantasy 1 and Final Fantasy 2 for the PS1. Features more detailed graphics, a remix OST, FMC, FMV sequences, art galleries, and a memo save function. In Final Fantasy 1, choose 1 to 6 classes to begin your journey. These classes can later be enhanced by finding a rat tail, as everyone knows. Magic also works very differently in 1. You can only memorize a set number of spells per spell level, and you can only have a few casts since there's no MP. In Final Fantasy 2, the class system is gone. In its stead, there's a new skill system. The more you use a weapon, the more proficient you'll become with it. Same goes for the more you get hit, the more HP slash defense you'll get, etc, etc. This game uses MP instead of spell charges, which is a vast improvement. Alright, so we're going to start with Final Fantasy 1. In Final Fantasy 1, you take on the role of the Four Heroes of Light. They begin in the Kingdom of Corneria, where they receive their first task. A former knight named Garland has gone rogue and kidnapped Princess Sarah. They must go to the ruined Temple of Fiends to rescue her, that, that is if Garland doesn't knock them all down first. They then embark on a grand quest to defeat Chaos and his four fiends, and save the world from destruction. Look, that's him, the Warrior of Light. Can you handle 12 at once, though? Okay, let's do normal mode. Uh, so... You have six classes. Warrior, Thief, Monk, Red Mage, Black Mage, and White Mage. And these can be further increased later on. So, I believe I recall that the pro way to play this is to have three Monks and a Red Mage when you eventually get Temper later on. Temper is like the best spell in the game. Thank you. 
There we go. That'll do. So, uh, yeah, it kinda just throws you right into it. This king is searching for the Light Warriors. Wait, can you be? Please go see his majesty. We do indeed be the Crystal Bearers. Darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. Please rescue my daughter, Sarah. Garland, once a knight as his majesty's surface, has abduct abducted Princess Sarah. We have learned that he is in the Temple of Chaos, north of Cornelia. He attempted to rescue the princess, but his power is far surpassed sorrows. Bring her back safely and I'll break, build you a new bridge. Okay. I'd rather have fast tech speed, thank you. See how they talk now. Oh, that's the fastest it goes. What? Unless it's the opposite. Oh, there we go. Four is just the slowest. I get you. Have driven him to such hatred. Isn't the other princess around here? Yep, there she is. Do I even have any money to my name? Very little. Alright, so Shimi should probably level up a little bit before going to fight Garland. Definitely need to get the Red Mage's sword. Hey there, handsome! So, we could buy Nunchaku for the, for the monk, but I think that would really be doing us a disservice. I think monk is just best with its fists. That was cheap.
So at level one magic, he can equip two spells. Oh well, not at all important. Okay, if you say so. Please move. Thank you. Right, you actually have to buy spells. Uh, 20 to 80 damage on dead foes. Raises defense by 8. Raises only evasion by 80. Uh... use a bit more gill, so let's do some fighting. Oops. I really love this world map theme. It's like, the, out of all the Final Fantasy map themes, this is like the most optimistic out of all of them. I should try maybe getting some the nunchaku. I don't know how much of a difference it'll make, but giving the rapier to the red mage seemed to help a lot. Maybe they're maybe it's better to have these until I actually start getting some levels.
Enemy strikes first. Wonderful. Nice misses, guys. Oh, I've got no potions, I just realized. Alright, so... He can equip three spells, but he can only use them twice at level one. I really did not like this uh, MP system. I not leveled yet? Nope. Wow. You level kind of slow. Holy cow! Potions are more expensive than <laughs> than the equipment. Okay, maybe we should just go for it. We'll buy one more spell, and then we'll head to the temple. So that way our red mage has a way of doing a spell as well. I've got eight guild to my name. Well, let's uh, go for it. And hope Garland doesn't knock us down, which she very well might. Oh, damn it. Just when I was about to give up hope. But now I need... Okay, I have enough guild to rest. That was a fairly significant amount of HP as well.
I think that thief would probably be the most useless class among the original six in this game. If you wanted a more balanced party, it'd be better to go like a uh, warrior, monk, uh, red mage, white mage, maybe. That'd be pretty good, I think. Yeah, now we're cooking. Needed that one level. Oh, Goblin Guard. Awesome. So is Garland just waiting for us in here? Yes, he is. Having Dia here might have been useful, because it deals extra damage to undead enemies. It also takes up a spell slot, so there's that as well. Ah! Spooky skeletons! Although maybe unneeded, considering we're dealing good damage. They were weaker than I thought. The door is locked with the mystic key. Ow. Okay, they don't go down quick, but they do hit hard. Are all these going to be locked? If they are, then I guess there's no point looking around. Yeah, I guess there's no point. Nice preemptive strike. Hey there, Garland. All of Cordelia and its riches will be mine! Blasted pawns of the king, no one can stop me now. 
I shall knock you all down! Ow. We did it. You're safe, Sarah. Kindle the light of the crystals. Only then will the monsters infesting the world be banished and peace be restored. I don't know, you could let us rest here or something. That'd be nice. Obtain the loot! I totally still need the rest after that. At least the load times in this don't seem terrible compared to, like, the other Final Fantasy compilations. I, I guess this is serviceable. There's that classic Final Fantasy theme. And so, their journey began. As warriors of light, the four youths faced a staggering mission 
and a stormy destiny. Four crystals they carried were remained a mystery to them. In ages past, those crystals had radiated a dazzling light. The time for heroes is at hand. Darkness must be banished, so the light of peace can illuminate the world once more. game would like properly begin. But that would be a good place to stop for Final Fantasy 1. Let's move on to Final Fantasy 2. Every other version. Okay, so Final Fantasy 2. In Final Fantasy 2, you take control of a man named Firion and his adopted siblings. One day, their village of Finn is attacked by the Palmesi Palamesian Empire, and they barely escape with their lives. This leads them to join the Wild Rose Rebellion as a means of combating the Empire. Emperor Ma Matthias leads the Empire in the hopes of conquering the entire world, and it'll be up to Ethereum and his friends to put an end to his evil ambitions. These are the Empire's goons, huh? So, um, when it comes to Final Fantasy 2, I don't really have 
a lot of knowledge on this game, mainly because I never really played it. I wasn't a, the biggest fan of the, uh, how this, the skill system works in this, where the more you, you attack something, the more skilled you become with it. But, um, these are our characters, Virian, Maria, Gus, and Leon. I think the third, the fourth character is always, like, in flux. But I think for the most part, you always have these three dudes, or at the very least, always Varian. Yeah. Wait, we already watched that. We gotta fight him. Set up. Wow. Uh. Oh, I didn't even get a chance to attack. Oh, that was quick. Short game. Uh oh god, flashing white light. Once the dreaded in Basque. Is that how you say that? Basque. Hey, look, he talks. But Leon not here. What home? It's been destroyed. Altair. Or Altair. However you pronounce it. What equipment do I start with? Broadsword, a bow, and an axe. Fair enough. Password is Wild Rose. Okay. 
That's a weird system. Hit in the back by, her, by an arrow. Nasty. I see treasure. Nice. Nothing in there. Fair enough. So I don't really know, like, if characters are, like, predisposed to, like, certain weapons, because they each start with, like, a particular one. I kind of want that javelin for the girl. But I can't afford it at the moment because of the gear I bought. expensive. Maybe I come here to revive people? That's my guess. Cow. Why are these things so expensive? For status curing stuff. Phoenix down is 5,000 gil? Holy crap. Uh, we, we better make sure we don't get knocked out. <laughs> or we're in trouble. Damn, these old Final Fantasies didn't play around.
Oh, great, we're poisoned all- we're, we're poisoned already! His endurance increased, though. That's that's great. Is he still poisoned? No, good. So, uh, I have no idea where I'm going, so we're just kind of exploring. Is there not experience in this? I don't see levels. Hmm. This definitely seems a bit more in-depth than uh, Final Fantasy 1. Yeah, I know that if you want to, like, raise your, like, defense, you're supposed to just, like, guard. Let enemies attack you. Yeah, they do. Uh, maybe there is no levels. Like I said, I don't really know that much about Final Fantasy II. That's just a mountain range. I know in Dis like Dissidia, Furion is like a master of all weapons. That's kind of cool. So, but I wonder if it's better to like just focus on working on one weapon at a time rather than uh, than trying to do like multiple weapons. Well, I think it's the first way. Gatria. Seven gil, what a steal. Compared to how expensive those items were.
might actually be better to keep her in the back row. It's probably leading more towards her being like a mage, if I had to guess. Oh, oops. Now, is there a magic shop here? Was that the item shop? Though I don't think it was. It could be that this town just doesn't have a magic shop, too. God damn, that's expensive. Looks like they do not have a magic shop. Oh well. I would have to do several more battles to be able to afford even one of those. Ow. Well, we're dead. Okay, well, that brings an abrupt end to that. <laughs> but yeah, I, I didn't have any idea where I was going, but it looks like I wandered too far and ended up someplace I shouldn't have been. Um, yeah, Final Fantasy II is kind of a weird game, and like I said, I don't really know that much about it. Um, the Final Fantasy that I really hate is Final Fantasy III, just because it does so many things wrong. It, the job system in Final Fantasy III is just terrible, and... Final Fantasy V, like, improved everything about it, pretty much. But, uh, yeah, this has been Final Fantasy Origins, or Final Fantasy 1 and 2, and it's a pretty cool compilation. <laughs>